Hello, my name is Jasmine McDonald. Welcome to my channel. If you are new here, I do ballet videos, fitness, exercise, vlog videos. Today, I thought it would be kind of fun to do a little reaction, if you will, to some of my dance videos and some ballet videos. I do have a millennia worth of dance DVDs. However, I have no actual physical way to put these DVDs onto this for you guys. These will be in another video. I will be reacting to some old photos and some old iPhone videos I had with this heavy <laughs> MacBook. They don't even make them anymore, so it's kind of dirty and dusty. I've had this trusty computer for 12 or 13 years now. I got it when I was 13 or 14, and I'm turning 25 this year. Without further ado, let's just get into it. This is fitting, right? Starting off, okay. If you were a teenager in the 2010s, you grew up with Tumblr. Whatever happened to Tumblr? This photo is of me and my friend. We were probably in grade 10 here. We had our tutus for the first time. So have that tutu. It was quite expensive, but it was one person that sewed the whole thing, made the whole thing from hand. Look at that bun. <gasps> Even in the mirror in the back, you can see my bun. That's a good bun. Okay, here's a photo from San Francisco Ballet School. I don't know why I chose to edit everything with a cat head on it when I was 17 either. I went in 2014 for a summer program. I really like that leotard that I'm wearing. I don't know what happened to it. I think I sold it when I was in Romania. I'm pretty sure when I really needed that coin, you know. Struggling artist vibes. There were beautiful studios. It was a beautiful experience there. I really grew a lot and learned a lot from a lot of different teachers and students that were also in my class. Everybody was really talented there. San Francisco Ballet, it's just amazing. So that was a really cool experience to be able to go to that summer school. This photo, I think I'm still using as a profile picture on some of my platforms. I think on Instagram it was a profile picture for a while and on Facebook it was my profile picture for a while. I really like this photo. Again, my friend Rachel or Cassie took this photo. I think it was my friend Rachel. May have been Cassie. <laughs> They're both phenomenal photographers. I'll have to ask one of them. This picture was taken also my grade 10 year. So as you can see, I'm wearing that tutu. I'm bent back a lot. She really bent back. My toes are pointed. <laughs> my hands are so long. My arms are so long. Oh my goodness. I'm like a monkey. I'm like an orangutan. I didn't realize how long my arms were until I saw this photo, I believe, when I was in grade 10. I was like, dang, she's got long arms. Okay, moving on. There's another photo from grade 10. Got a little flower in my hair, got my makeup all done. I'm a little bit too far on my leg, I'd say, and my knee's a little bit too raised. I look like I'm a clean dog, but that's okay. I'm learning, I'm living. Ooh! Okay, I know this photo was actually taken by Cassie. We went on a photo shoot one day to the harbor in Toronto and it was so fun. We actually got to go on somebody's boat and take really cool pictures. I'll have to share some of those too because I'm really excited. I love those pictures. Um, I still use these pictures to this day. 15 here, I'm pretty young. They're amazing. I mean, the colors are just impeccable. Point shoes are the exact point shoes that I need to be wearing and that I love to wear. I know in my point shoe videos, I get a lot of comments that my point shoes don't fit me and I know that they don't. I'm retired now and I can't afford to get shoes right now. <laughs> but these are the exact shoes. These are the Street Studio Pros with a V-cut vamp and a hard shank. I love these shoes. I love them. They look amazing. And then here's another photo of me in these shoes and you can see how supported my arch is and how they're not bent. This is actually my first year in point. And for my first year at professional ballet school, I'm impressed. I'm impressed, Jasmine. I'm very impressed by you. Here's another photo from grade 10. I think this must have been like a performance day or something, or our parents were visiting. Look at how dirty those shoes are. I like how the piano is like glimmering and everything's like super shiny and beautiful. And then my shoes just ruin it because they're so dirty. <gasps> Girl, you need to wash those. Stinky stink. Oh. Okay, here's another photo from one of those days, doing a little ponche. I could point that back foot a little bit more. It's a little bit crunched and two winged. Um, my fingers have a lot of energy going through them. I like that. The bun though, 
the bun though. The bun needs some work. I'm so sad about that bun. I'm not even gonna talk about it any longer. I love this photo. It's so nice. The only thing that really bugs me and irks me is the bottom foot. It's just a little bit off the point, if you know what I mean. But I like the photo. I'm young here and I'm doing my best. I look like I'm enjoying it. I'm kidding, I don't. I'm like, ah. but um, I really like this photo. I know it's not perfect and my alignment's a little bit skewed and I definitely could make it nicer, like remake it. My face looks so sweet, even though the bun's a little bit questionable. Again, I have no idea what I was doing there. I think my hair's straight back as well. I don't know, it's got a little bit of a part. That was a side part. That was the millennia of side parts. Comment down below if you're team side part or team middle part. I've converted, I was always die hard side part. Ooh, okay. This photo, not the best quality right now because it was an iPhone photo. This is the one that got me going on Instagram at that time. This photo like blew up. It went on Worldwide Ballet. It went on a ton of different um, Tumblr pages. I remember seeing it all over Pinterest and people tagging me and sending me pictures like, hey, I found your photo on this random website. Dang, she's flexible. I am not that flexible anymore. I wish. I wish I was that flexible again. That's flexibility goals right there. <laughs> I don't know why I chose this pose in this picture. I'm doing an attitude and I'm on a rise, on a demi point, if you will. And I've got my foot on the piano. I feel like that's such a faux pas. That's just, I'm just gonna skip through that. That fifth position does not exist. She's not even in this realm. And that hand grabbing the bar, okay, I understand why my teachers at the time were like, Jasmine, relax. This is one of the pictures we took, me and Cassie took on the boat. My eyes kind of look closed there, but again, the shoes look great. The tights are really rolled up. Like, I don't know how I wasn't cutting off my calf circulation. Bomb photo. Like, look at that skyline. Look at that water. Look at those colors pop. I've got a couple of photos at Golden Gate Bridge. This is just one of them. We had the likes of Cynthia Harvey teaching us. Parrish Maynard was there as well. Fabrice Herolt, amazing summer school. Probably the best in my books. If you're looking at summer schools to go to, go to San Francisco Ballet School or try to audition for it because it was game changer for me. We're gonna get into a couple of videos that are iPhone videos. So they're gonna be super low quality, but that's fine, that's fine. I was such a nerd. I used to just go in the studio and like <laughs> record myself doing like fuertes. I'm really exposing myself here. I used to just practice like a good little student. Okay, so I'm walking away. You can hear the point she's squeaking. Turn and a turn. Nice, not fifth position, but okay. Oh. I'm not too shocked. I know I never crossed my fifth position. <laughs> I like to walk away. <laughs> Try the left side, go for the left side. Yes. And, oh, okay, she's doing, ooh, look at those PKs though. <gasps> I'm impressed by those PKs. I'm really impressed. I've not seen any of these before. I'm just picking literal random ones. Okay, oh, she's going for fuetes. <gasps> oh! Wow! That was clean. If that was one of my students doing it, you get a good pat on the back. Very good. I am impressed. You go, Jazzy. I have no idea what I was doing, and I don't know why I was alone, <laughs> honestly. Okay, nice B plus, and a carte. Run, développe, releve, parabouré, and a turn, lame duck. Yes, I used to love these, oh my goodness. I still love them, especially when I was in company, like we finished our class and we'd just be able to do whatever we wanted at the end of the class, just kind of like, the pianist would play music and we do like fuetes, we go from the corner, we do menage, stuff like that. And I would literally just like clean ducks. And I'd see the eye of a maestro and he'd be like, gotcha. I think I look like a bug now, but I'm like a prey mantis here. <gasps> Lilac fairy. Da -na -na -na. I guess that was 
was it. I just wanted to see what it looked like on me and I was like, yeah, no, it's not for me. More lame ducks, you see my, oh, again, there's no, <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. <gasps> I'm really exposing myself here. I hope this just gives people hope. The way I just like out of it and didn't even. That was good. I can't do that right now. So again, very impressed with myself. Okay, I just need to pause it for a second. Look at how high up my leotard is hiked. This thing, it's hiked up so high. I remember we used to like roll them up too and they used to literally be like <gasps> up to our belly buttons, like above our bones. We used to like roll them up too. <laughs> I don't know why I'm going over like this. And I don't know why I keep recording, why I didn't just hit stop. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Anyways, thank you so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed this kind of video. I know it was different than stuff I usually have on my channel, but I really enjoyed going through these photos and videos with you guys. Let me know what you want to see next in the comments down below. Don't forget to give a like if you liked this video. Subscribe, I post every Tuesday and Thursday. And thanks again for watching. Have a great rest of your day. Bye now. I can take this off now. Bye.